Let us continue with our lesson and today we will be learning a basic difference about the Kotlin and Kotlin interface and abstract class. If you have been following along that we have already completed on a lecture on a interface as well as an abstract class. So if you have completed these two lectures by now you should be wondering or you may be a bit confused about all of these two interface and abstract class and uh, yeah that's uh, quite confusing and at, at the first but if you take a closer look on an interface and abstract class in kotlin it's quite similar the difference is that only a small difference is there which is our abstract property so whenever we create a uh, any property in an interface by default is the abstract and we cannot have a non-abstract property over here whereas in an abstract class if you notice over here we can have a normal property as well as an abstract property but if you are in an interface you cannot have a normal property and you can only have an abstract property in the interface rest of the function and abstract function is by by default an abstract and here in abstract class we have to make a keyword of abstract to make a function as a abstract and also we have to make a keyword make use of an open keyword on a normal function if you want to overwrite this in a child class whereas in the interface by default the function is a abstract and by default all the normal function are open so which means that we can override and the all of the functions are abstract by default it's, we don't have to make uh, make use of a keyword as an abstract over here and uh, that's the main difference and uh, for the property over here uh, if you want to expose it or if you want to override or if you want to set a property uh, set a value for this property we have to make use of a accessor method which is of getter uh, and setter so we can just set set a gate over here and we can assign a value for each one and say we can assign a value and uh, if you never have an accessor property over here if you never set the accessor for provide the accessor for your property by default it's an abstract and you must have to override in your subclass so i think that's uh, all the basic difference and if you go through it uh, you will get it and uh, i would like you guys to go and practice it just make sure that you understand that by default in interface all of the properties is abstract and the function is also by default an abstract everything you write is abstract over here and if you have a method with a body over here that is by default uh, which means it's a non-abstract and if it is by default an open whereas in our abstract class we have to make use of an abstract keyword to make our function as abstract as well as if you want to override the normal function in a subclass then we have to make use of a keyword of a open so i hope you guys got it the basic difference between the interface as well as abstract class in a kotlin and i hope this will clear some of the confusion in a kotlin interface as well as an abstract class so we will continue with our lesson on our next video till then have a great day